Clients who have thoracic pain and dysfunction often have limits in their ability to use their ribs effectively. Often the ribs are locked in inspiration. We figure that out through our clinical examination that we teach in the, in the course for thoracic spine and ribs. When we found a rib that is locked in inspiration, we want to now treat it with a little technique that uses breathing and gentle mobilization with arm elevation to help reduce that stuck position of the rib. In order to do that, we place the client sideline, we'll cradle her arm beginning overhead, not fully elevated until we get our hands placed. We'll go to the rib that we found to be inspired, make room, placing our second MCP in the intercostal space above the rib that's inspired. We'll then elevate our arm to the point where we begin to feel that rib move further into inspiration. In a stride position, so I can manage my own body mechanics, I place the hand with the elbow extended in a direction where I can gently push that rib into expiration. The rib likes to move like a pump handle, so I'm going to move the pump handle into an area of expir or direction of expiration. And then I'll ask her to take in a gentle breath in, let it out. As she lets it out, I gently push the rib further into expiration. I can bring the arm up into more elevation, ask her to take a breath in, let it out, more gentle expiration of the rib, maybe add more elevation of the arm. And I can work that for several repetitions, where at the end I'll ask her to take a little deeper breath and then come out of that position and let her relax. This technique allows you to take the rib out of an inspired position and encourage expiration, reducing the dysfunction and reducing your client's pain.